Hello, it's Sunday morning. I'm here with Poppy and today we're doing our first ever uh, virtual run. It's a, it's a 5k today and please don't be fooled by the sunshine. Um, as nice as it looks and it's always nice to have some sunshine out. It is absolutely freezing. The wind is blowing through and um, personally, yeah, I just want to get on with this. But I wanted to do a quick video first. Um, if you haven't come across virtual running, it's a bit like uh, an organized race that you just do in your own time and then you provide the evidence of completion having done it. So it gives a lot more flexibility uh, rather than have to be somewhere on a certain day at a certain time, which obviously is great, I've done lots of those in the past. Um, this has given a lot more flexibility to us, yet also given the purpose to, to get out today um, in this sunny cold and to actually be active. And you know, I know personally from my own experience that running, exercise, boot camp, you know, really helps with my mental well-being, uh, helps with my mental health, helps with my physical health. I feel much better for doing it. Um, sometimes I even enjoy doing it, but definitely afterwards I feel better. Uh, helps with stress. And recently there was research, uh, which is really pertinent to running and exercise, that suggests that running can protect our memory from chronic stress. So if we're experiencing chronic stress, then it can really impact on our memory, our ability to recall stuff and our ability to learn. And this research suggests that exercise and particularly running may have a protective benefit um, for our brains. So again, another reason to get out there as well as our mental health, our physical health, is actually dealing with that kind of stuff, protecting our brains from chronic stress. Um, that comes on top of other evidence to get out there and to exercise. Um, research that suggests that exercise, um, even a small amount of exercise, can help prevent or or reduce the symptoms of depression. Um, and you know that research also suggests that people who are more active and do exercise are probably less likely to suffer with depression. So again, another reason why exercise is good for our mental health. And there's also even more research that's come out recently that suggests that um, our brain is protected by ex exercise in that as our, we get older, uh, our brain functioning can decrease and exercise is thought to keep our brain healthier for longer. So again, you know, all good reasons to get ex ex yeah, can't say that, get out exercising. And we're gonna crack on now with our 5K. Um, I've got all my layers on, I've got my hat on, I've got my gloves on, I've got about 10 layers on to try and keep me warm. Um, so yeah, if you're thinking about getting exercise, you know, it's a good thing to do to just start building up for your mental health, for your physical well-being. If you are already exercising, then you know, even more reasons to continue. And we're gonna crack on and I will speak to you soon. Bye now.